hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we are reviewing the newest skincare line to hit the makeup industry which is by none other than the legend itself mac cosmetics mac has been around for forever like mac is the og the icon the legend like they have been doing the best things in the makeup industry you guys know i love mac so i am super excited for this line this is a new skincare line they dropped which is called hyper real the whole idea behind hyper real is that it is a skincare line with skincare benefits but it is meant to be used also really well with makeup it is approved by makeup artists to work with makeup without disrupting your makeup so there's no pilling there's no breakage nothing so we're gonna put that to the test today i'm gonna show you guys how to use it tips tricks before and afters and we're gonna put it to the test and see how it works with oily skin so if you guys are interested, please keep on watching. But before we get into the video, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give the video a like, turn your post notifications on, add me on Instagram, add me on TikTok. And now that you've done all those things, let's get into the video. So this is about to be your new best friend. And let me tell you why. The whole idea behind the Ceramizer is that it's a serum and moisturizer in one. It's a hybrid formula. So you don't need to use a moisturizer. However, if you want to, you can. But this right here is your serum and your moisturizer. This has so many nourishing, delicious ingredients in here that is about to make your skin look amazing so many benefits so one thing that it has is hyaluronic acid which we already know hyaluronic acid is really hydrating it helps retain moisture it helps seal in moisture so that right there is a plus it also has ceramides which protects the skin barrier and also helps with moisture retention and and it doesn't stop there it also has niacinamide ahas BHAs, which help boost your cell turnover and minimize your pores your fine lines so this right here it would be amazing for somebody that also has oily skin like me because you already know I'm oily. I always find that some serums add too much of like a glow to me that I'm like looking really, really oily. But this right here, because of the niacinamide and all the other ingredients, works for all skin types, especially oily skin because of the niacinamide, all of that. And it's going to blur the pores. Like I said, people with oily skin usually have enlarged pores. So this right here, honey is about to minimize those pores, those fine lines, and just help overall with your skin's retexturizing. And then the cherry on top to seal the deal is the Japanese peony in here, which is exclusive to MAC, really rare, and it's everything we need because the Japanese peony is gonna give you that radiance. It's gonna even out your skin over time. It's literally gonna give you like that soft petal-like skin. And the whole story behind Japanese peony is it's very rare, like a very rare petal. And it blooms, I believe, seven to 10 days after winter. And the petals are hand picked. And after they're hand picked, they dry out naturally in the sun and then they're used in the product. So just a little, just a little info there for you guys. But yeah, I'm actually very excited. I've never tried a product with Japanese peony in it because again, it's very rare. So it's super exciting that MAC was able to get that in the skincare line because we need it. We need to try all that stuff out. You can actually even use this as like a mixing medium kind of thing. So you can use this to mix into your foundation. You can use it to mix into like a blush, into a bronzer, to kind of create it into a cream. Like this can literally be a makeup mixing medium as well, not just skincare. So it can do tons of things for us. So this one, as you can see, is one of my favorite things that I'm excited about. So now let's get into the Skin Canvas Balm. So I only have like a little mini size on it because right now I do have another, I have like two moisturizers that I'm using, so I kind of want to wait till I finish those before I go and use another one. But this is the little mini, super cute, super tiny. So this one also comes in two sizes. The full size is 50 ml, $65. The mini size is $29, not this, this is a tester or a sample, but the smaller one is $29. So this is a protective moisturizing cream that supports a strong barrier while smoothing skin immediately and over time. It's for normal dry combination oily skin, so for all skin types. The purpose of this moisturizer is to help with dryness and uneven texture. It is a cream formula, so it's not a gel moisturizer, it's a cream moisturizer. And this also features the resilient and rare Japanese peony extract that I was mentioning to you guys earlier, visibly refining niacinamide, hydrating and visibly plumping hyaluronic acid, and restorative ceramides to deliver immediate and long-lasting results. 
Typically, because I'm oily, I like to wear more of a gel-based moisturizer. In the winter, I do switch to a cream moisturizer because my skin is so dry. Like right now, it feels so tight. So I would use something like this probably for the winter. I think for the summer it might be a little too much for an oily skin girl like me but we're gonna try this out we're gonna put this to the test so the price of this is 47 canadian and the bristles are 100 percent synthetic the bristles are so soft like when i tell you they are so silky and soft it literally feels like a cloud like they're so soft like i need you to feel the bristles it's amazing and because of the dome sized shape on it it really like hugs your cheeks and it just allows you to really apply that skincare so it absorbs in without pulling, without tugging to give you that nice smooth makeup application. So I'm excited to try this out. And when you use this brush, it also gives you a micro exfoliation. So it gives you like a really nice instant rosy glow because of the exfoliation that it'll give you. So this is something we all need. So this right here is not just a makeup remover. It is going to obviously dissolve your makeup without stripping it. It's going to make sure your skin's still hydrated, doesn't feel tight or dry or anything. So it's still going to make sure it takes off all your makeup without that. It's going to cleanse away impurities and pollutants and micro dust. So it's going to take everything off, not just the makeup, everything. And then it's also going to strengthen your skin barrier because of all the other ingredients like the vitamin E, the Japanese peony, all of that in it. So this is going to give you a lot of benefits. And the cool thing about this right here is that it's actually meant to use twice a day so you're going to use it in the morning before you actually start your whole skincare routine because of all of the skincare ingredients it's kind of just going to wake up your skin and kind of get it prepped and ready for your makeup application so you're going to use this in the morning and then you're also going to use it at night to remove your makeup so again another two in one okay so that is all the tea on the hyper real line i wanted to make sure that i really spent time on each product giving you guys all like the background information all of that before i actually do the application because i need you guys to know all the benefits to it so now that we've done all that let's get into the demo i'm going to start with the ceramizer i'm going to do two pumps and then i'm going to use my skincare brush of course wow this just feels so luxurious you know what i'm gonna just put it on here this feels so luxurious i literally feel like i'm getting a facial the serum feels so lightweight it's literally just sinking into my skin which is super important when you're doing a makeup application because sometimes some serums are really rich that it takes like a while for it to sink and I'm literally just sitting there waiting or else my makeup starts to move and break apart. But this right here, it literally already just like sunk into my skin. So amazing. So that's what the serum is like. Again, you can already see it gives you a glow. Like my skin is already glowy with just itself. Like look at this right here. Stunning. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to try the Skin Canvas Balm. And I'm going to try this on just one half of my face because, again, this is a moisturizer. Like I said earlier, this is a hybrid, so it's already a serum and a moisturizer. But I want to try it with this as well. But I'm going to only do it on one side so that I can compare and see how it looks throughout the day. Because, again, I'm oily, so I kind of want to see um, if that works for me. So this is what it looks like. So you can see it is a more of like a rich moisturizer. I'm excited to see how it works with my skin type. Really hydrating, actually. Wow. But not uncomfortable, if you know what I mean. Sometimes I get uncomfortable when it's too hydrating because it's very thick and really rich. But this is literally just sinking in. I'm going to go ahead and use some primer. This is the mattifying 12 hour shine control. I use this all the time because like I said, I'm oily. So I like to make sure I use something that will help control my oil. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this on. Now that I used that brush, I already feel like I am too good to be using my fingers. Like I feel like I need a, pri a brush for my primer now. This is my foundation. I'm actually going to mix it in with the ceramizer because like I said, you could also use it as a mixing medium to kind of bring back that glow since the primer did mattify my skin i still want to bring back that glow so i'm going to mix it in and as you can see it just blends in so beautiful it gives you that nice glow and this foundation itself is a mattifying foundation so i'm going to use that together and see how that works so my makeup is done and 
I am obsessed. Literally the entire time I was doing my makeup, I just kept thinking how smooth everything was going on. There was no pilling, there was no breakage of like the makeup, nothing. Everything was so flawless. So I am so happy with how it looks. You can see my skin looks super glowy still, even though I used a mattifying primer. It definitely toned it down, the glow, but you can still see there's still a glow radiating through it, but it's not too much, but I am obsessed. So what I'm gonna do as like a last little step is I'm gonna use a ceramizer and I'm going to just layer it on top of my highlighter to kind of see if I can intensify it a little bit more because again, you can use a ceramizer in so many different ways. You could use it on top of makeup. You can mix it into makeup, which I mix it into the foundation. So you can just see it literally lays perfectly it's not disrupting the makeup or anything like look at that you can already see it's just making it more glowy wow you can just see it just gives you a nice glaze almost like a donut glaze you know that wet look it just really amplified that highlighter so i love this i feel like i'm gonna start doing this every time i do my highlighter just to amp it up a little bit that looks really good wow this just like took it to another level Love. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, you know what? While we're here, I might as well just add some on my lip too. I feel like I could even use it as like a lip balm almost. Look at that. This lipstick was a matte lipstick, but this like just made it more hydrating. Wow. So take a final look. This is what it looks like. What I'm gonna do is I am about to go to work So I'm gonna wear this for the entire day It's about to be a long day and I'm gonna see how it wears throughout the day how my makeup looks if I'm super oily If I'm super glowy, we're gonna see how this works throughout the day So I'm gonna come back in a few hours Maybe like eight hours or so and check in and then show you guys the final look and then we're gonna talk about it and Decide if we love it or not. So I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, so I am home from work. It has been 10 hours of me wearing this makeup with the Hyper Real skincare. So now let's get into it and let's talk about it. So let me move in closer and show you guys the overall finish. I haven't done any touch ups, no blotting, no powder, no blotting sheets, absolutely nothing. So this is exactly how I just looked all day. And remember, we used the Ceramizer all over. I used the Skin Balm and Ceramizer on this side. And I even mixed the Ceramizer into the foundation and layered it on top of my highlighter. So the Ceramizer was used a lot. So this is what it looks like and it's giving. It's giving skin, it's giving glow, it's giving healthy, like I am obsessed my makeup has never looked so good i feel like even though i'm oily it's still giving me a really nice glow but not overly glowy not greasy looking like she's just looking real healthy real glowy like i am obsessed and when i tell you the amount of compliments i got at work today say that they love my skin and they love how glowy i am and what's crazy is because i'm so oily i usually don't like glowy things because if you guys have been here for a while on my channel you guys know if i am too glowy i hate it i'm like no can't do it but this right here i feel like it gives me the perfect amount of glow that it still makes me look healthy and glowy but I'm not overly dewy, like I love using this to mix stuff in together and kind of play around. You guys saw me even put this on my lips and it gave my lips such like a nice moisturized feeling after my, my matte lipstick. So even on my lips, like it's just wild. I was literally telling one of my girls at work today how I use a ceramizer. I was like, girl, I use the ceramizer as my skin base. I used it into my foundation. I use it on top of my highlighter and I used it on my lip. And she literally was like, okay, so basically you're eating it at this point. Like you're using it for everything. And I was like, you know what? I just might, I just might because it's that good. Like I feel like this right here can be used for everything. Like I'm about to use it for a hair mask. I'm about to use it for everything on my body. Like I feel like on my body would actually really be really hydrating. So I used this on this side with the ceramizer and this one just the ceramizer. Honestly, by looking, I feel like they both have the exact same amount of glow. This one looks a little bit more glowy on my cheek, just a little bit, but not much of a difference. If you're more like normal to dry skin and you really want that extra glow, then yes, get this as your moisturizer. For my oily skin people, I feel like it could work for you if you like that dewiness, if you do like that glow. 
But if I had to choose between these, I would definitely say the Ceramizer and even the brush. I feel like these are a must together. Like, it's just so luxurious. You know, we're 2023 is all about self-care. So. This is definitely a hit. This is definitely on my top list of great products for 2023 already. And obviously what I can do is like blot down a little bit of like the shine, like right here, a little bit right here. I can definitely tone it down with like a blotting powder. But again, for the video, I didn't do any touch-ups today just for video purposes, but typically what I would have done already is like blotted just a little bit here, because this is where it's like a little extra oily or dewy. But overall, guys, that's all I have to say. As you guys can see, the Hyper Real is a 10 out of 10 in my books. Definitely recommend you need to run Pick it up. Let me know in the comments down below your thoughts. Do you guys love it? Do you guys hate it? Have you tried it? Honestly, like I said, my biggest my biggest thing with this line is that it's skincare, but it's approved by makeup artists. MAC has been doing its thing for years. Like MAC is an OG, a legend, an icon. And they have cultivated a skincare line that is meant to work really well with makeup to not disrupt it. Because as makeup artists, they know the struggle of certain skincare products pilling or like breaking it apart, making it not wear as long. They understand. So I feel like I trust it. Like I trust them to come up with a skincare line to work with the makeup products plus the additional benefits. Hands down, I'm sold. So let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Let me know what you guys want to see next and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.